Matsuri. Traditional Matsuri are held all over Japan. Mainly, they are held in spring to pray for abundant crops and in autumn to show thanks for the good harvests. However, in Tohoku and other areas, the big festivals are concentrated in summertime. For example, Kyoto's Gion Festival and Daimonji Fire Festival are both held in summer. Prayers are offered for the elimination of disease and pestilence. In addition, each area has its own fireworks display and Obon festival dance. Matsuri are essentially sacred festivals, so both the local Shinto shrine congregation and the people take leading roles. It is all very formal and strict rules about the proceedings are already set. Local people carry a portable shrine called Mikoshi on their shoulders. However, in recent years, with the declining population, there are not enough locals to do it. Therefore, it is increasingly common to invite participants from other areas. Some even encourage spectators to join in on the spot. So, even foreign visitors who have just come to watch can participate and enjoy the festival. People will probably lend you a happy, a short festival robe, a yukata, a casual summer kimono, or a headband to help brighten up the festival. What's more, they will probably teach you the dance and let you beat the drums. And I'm sure they will offer you some ceremonial sake too. Therefore, you shouldn't be shy, but rather join the group and actively enjoy the festival. On the approach to the shrine and in its open space, there are lines of yatai. These are the official stalls where you can buy lots of food, toys, and games. Videos of most famous Japanese festivals can be seen on YouTube and other such websites. So, to avoid missing any of the fun, make sure you gather information beforehand.